one on, and here's Maglio Ordonez. And Ordonia settles in towards the middle. Fantastic chance here. Gotta love that first pitch fastball right where he wanted. He was thinking right back up the middle. Base hit the center. The pitch. Right Getting the fish for that one. Nothing and one. Well, they're taking advantage of the opportunity so far in this game, just blowing them out here, and now getting more men on base again. So this offense has been relentless. Swings, lines this one back up the middle. He'll throw on to first, and that'll do it for this half inning. No runs and a couple of hits and two left on. San Francisco five, Colorado nothing. Top of the lineup coming up. Take a look there, Jim Tracy. This has been a test here today for him and his team. Yeah, feel that Rocky Mountain high. The pitch from Pettit just off the outside, and it's 1-0. Oh. Again, we're into the fourth inning right now, and as you start to flip the lineup over again, you know, they've only gotten two hits, so they're going to have to really evaluate what they should be looking for at the plate, and maybe they need to be a little bit more patient and make them work. He looks at that fastball, called strike, two and one. He's just popping that glove with that four-seam fastball, pounding the strike zone. And McLeod swings and misses at that one. We've got an even count. The 2-2 two -two coming. Cutter misses, and it's full, three and two. Now, he didn't chase that one. That pitch down and away. Good movement on the cut fastball. He just You're laid out. off of it. It's a pitch with two strikes. You better be swinging at though. Well, he finished that one off with a strikeout. Nice pitch. This one's right down the middle. He just swung and missed at it. Gotta check his back for a hole. First pitch on the way to Gordon. Here's a swing and a fly ball to right center. This one's going to be fielded by Ardonias. As he gets a little exercise that time. Chance here with two down for Jason Bay. 0 for 1 thus far. There's a strike from Pettit. Now 0 and 1. He looked like he was looking for a pitch out over the plate. That fastball down and in locked him up a little bit. We've got Brandon in the box. Oh, Gary, we see that guy get hit with a pitch. I mean, sometimes the... there's a swing and a line drive. And that one is through in the left. And he is safe at second. Time to capitalize for Colorado right now. And we've got Montero batting. we get another shot after hitting into that double play last time up. And 0-1 by Pettit. Hit up the middle. We see a good inning from Andy Pettit. He's kept his focus. The shutout continues through four. And here's Mark DeRosa leading it off. And DeRosa ready for the first pitch. Now here's a grounder towards the hole. And that's out number one stepping in the bag. And Cora is batting. Single home run in his last at bat. Swing and a ball line softly towards second. And Rodriguez takes care of that one. Cut it at the plate. He flew out his last time up. Base is empty with two up. And here's the pitch. Strike one. It's strike one. Can't make contact on the fastball. Okay, the only way you're going to get back into this ball game is if you get your hitters back in the dugout. And, you know, two outs here with nobody on, and at least maybe some momentum starting to shift. So Curtis Granderson will come up. Well, you know what? I've seen better swings in a park with the pitcher able to pick up a base hit right there. And hey, nothing like helping yourself. First count on Granderson. Here it comes. Swing and a drive, deep left center. McLeod will field. That one's grabbed. Side retired. No runs on a hit, and they'll strand. 
San Francisco five Colorado nothing. It's going to be Rodriguez now. David, he gets some serious respect being shown here. They're, oh, they're going to give him a free pass to start this out. Now, this isn't good baseball. I don't care how good a guy is. You just don't put the leadoff hitter on base like this. You're asking for trouble. Ball one. And he takes it inside. One and oh. The pitch from Pettit. Long out and missed, and it's one and one. And he looks at a fastball in there, and it's one and two now. Velocity and location are absolutely critical. That pitch was exactly where he wanted to throw it. Got him there. That was a nice strikeout. A good two strike fastball in on his hand. He couldn't pull the trigger. And the first pitch. Swung on, hit. This one's towards Granderson. That's the second out. Team leaders in home runs. How'd they do it last year? Well, let's take a look at our State Farm leaderboard. Number one, the Phillies. The Rockies in second. Third spot, the Brewers. Fourth, D backs. And at number five, it's the Cubs. We see so many games won with one swing of the bat and a shot up the middle, Pedroia. Up next, Nate McClellan. Gary may have surprised himself right there. Good piece of hitting by the pitcher. Hey, nothing like giving yourself a little offensive support. First pitch inside with the fastball, ball one. Last year, three for 15 off the Giants. It's hit foul by McLeod. McLeod isn't fooled by that pitch, and the count is evened up. Right on it, but he fouls it straight back. Tough pitch to lay off that time. Full count, 3 2. And here's the 3 2. And that misses. Ball four. He has loaded him up. Well, after a long, epic battle, this at bat ends in a walk. Are you kidding me? Someone should have got struck out or someone should have got a hit. But the hitter will take the swing and a shot. Third. And he's in there third. Way ahead of the draw. And they bring him home. Openings for this lineup offensively. Don't give it to him now because they are hot. And here's Jason Bay. He's looking to bring this runner home. Back up the middle. Oh, he's going to try to make the play. Throws on to first in time to retire the side. The inning complete for Andy Pettit. He's looking to preserve that good lead and get a W. The Giants on top.